Hey everyone, Edgy Berserker here with Tech and Tag Tournament 2. Alright, we're gonna keep going solo though. Because we left off with uh, Roger Jr., even though his mom does all the work. No, wait. We left off with Raven. Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. I remember. Okay. Yeah, Raven. Anyway, <laughs> we played Raven. He, he, did, he did all the work himself, unlike this little shit. Anyways, uh, now we're on to Bruce. Okay, let's see what Bruce got. Oh, he's also a Captain Falcon. That's pretty cool. And I'm gonna give him a tracksuit, because why not? Man just got up. He's like, okay. Get ready for Guess I gotta go to work and go to a fighting tournament, but I can't be uncomfortable. Time to be comfortable. I could wear my uh, my shorts and all, sure, but but I want to wear this instead because it's super comfy. <laughs> oh, Bruce! You got replaced by a guy that looks straight out of Backy the Grappler. You're still a cool guy, though. <laughs> you know that guy down there is just like, what the hell? <laughs> Oh, are they cooking? Oh, I think they're cooking. I'm serving the cooking. Too busy fighting. But it's fine. I did it. Good job, Bruce. Get ready for the next battle. Oh man. I had so many problems getting uh D third up, but it's okay now. <laughs> this time I know what to do. And also, um, I ran an experiment. Final round. I, uh, I managed to hack my 3DS, <laughs> but for the sole purpose of being able to, uh, stream it, you know? So I tried the Wi-Fi setup. Now, I think the biggest flaw of the, the program is, is very, well, big but minor at the same time, because depending on the games I want to play, it's not a big deal. <laughs> Like, I know how to put the sound into the system. I just did a little rejigger on that, and it worked pretty nice. Get ready for the next battle. Oh, excuse me. And so, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. But uh, you have to prioritize either your top screen or your bottom screen. So one screen's going to have a lovely frame rate, while the other one's going to be ball sacky vinegar. <laughs> so, but, like, for instance, for saying uh, if I decide to play... Shimigami Tensei 4. Top screen's a priority because bottom screen's more like my menus and shit. So, like, I would be keeping that on the small, anyways. And it includes map, too, so it's no big deal. So, a game like that, cool. Same with Strange Journey. God, I love Strange Journey Redux. But then when it comes to, like, rhythm games and that, that'd be a little different. Um, but you know, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna do some testing because, like, even like Pokemon games, battle. you can concentrate more on like the top screen as opposed to the bottom screen, right? So that oh, that basically what I'm saying is this opens up a lot of stuff for me, including DS games. Like, holy crap, this is great. Which also means I can cover weirdo fighting game ports like, oh, I don't know, Dead or Alive Dimensions? Oh, shit. And that one is a top screen priority game regardless. So, hey, this gives us, this gives us options. I like this. It's good options. Options are very good indeed. I'm trying to think if I have any uh, other fighting games other than uh, Dead or Alive Dimensions. I don't think I do. Not for like the 3DS or DS. So guaranteed if I found out about that uh, fighting lair demo one that they were going to release, but then they, uh, you know, nothing happened with it. I would totally have bought that game. <laughs> Oh, it's exciting though. Oh my god. And I got like so many RPGs. Like things just opened up. This is this is good. This is good in quality. Edgy likes this. <laughs> so yeah, I'm happy about that. Like obviously 
Those will not be live stream though, because uh, I have to like stream it via Wi-Fi onto my computer. So a live stream would totally like bungle my uh, system down. Even though my connection's really good, I don't, you know, it seems dicey sometimes with stuff like that. So <laughs> it'll definitely be a recording thing only for YouTube. But hey, that's cool. Again, more options. Battle. More options are good. <laughs> Yeah, I'm excited. I could care less about like, you know, like putting ROMs and shit on it, you know? I just I just want to play other games and show it and, ah, it's gonna be good. I like it. Oh my god. Because I missed out on uh, getting a mod for my uh, 3D, my little 3DS, right? It kind of sucks, so. Ah, what can you do, right? Because that place that did the main modding's closed down. And even like the other people, it's like they're gonna, once their stock's out, they're done with it. So it's like, oh, well, there we go. <laughs> That's okay though. At least the Snicker stream way worked. Uh, like I have a. Uh... God, I can't believe I have four 3DSs. <laughs> I have the uh, Persona uh, Q1, which is my favorite 3DS. The original. So that little silver thing. Oh my god, wait, no. Hold up. I'm wrong. That's a DS. <laughs> but I do have, uh, I have my little purple uh, 3DS, the original 3DS, so that one's fine. Um, and then I also got, um, what was it? The Creamsicle Orange one, the new 3D, 2DS, and that one is actually, that's my one that I, uh, hacked. And then I have, uh, my Monster Hunter one, which is very pretty. So, yeah. DS's. I love the DS series, though, like the 3DS, DS, whatever S. Get new 3DS featuring battle. Dante from the Devil May Cry series. I think it's because a lot of Shin Megami Tensei's were released on there. That's why. <laughs> now that I think about it. Well, shit. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Now oh, then I could cover stuff like Project X Zone and shit. Oh, my God. Hell, yeah. Oh, my God, Bruce. Talking about 3DS doesn't mean while I don't even pay attention. <laughs> hop, hop, hop. Though, emulation wise, I'd probably still have to, like, if I want to do the Thor game, I'd probably have to emulate that one for the DS. A lot of people don't know that the Thor uh, 3DS release, or DS release, I should say, is actually a, a not bad um, license game. It's completely different from the Wii, Xbox, or whatever fuck they released it for. But the, for the DS version yeah. is done by Way Forward, so you have gorgeous sprite work. And it's kind of like an Odin Sphere uh, clone in a way. But with, like, Thor from Marvel. <laughs> and it's a fun-ass game, I gotta say. I like that this uh, Bruce episode turned into the uh, DS and 3DS talk. Because we're having good rock talk here. I'm getting my ass kicked and I don't know how to fight her. Ah! So usually I'd switch off to Dragunov at this point. But I didn't. Okay. Those are the jump kicks I want. They don't have a wind up. And it's all good. Kick box. Kick, punch, it's all in the mind. If you want to test me, I'm sure you'll find. Stompy, stompy. <laughs> got her. Okay, that's the one round. But we got unknown still. Woo! Keep going, Brucey. Oh my god. Sorry if I go quiet. Oh, and I know I have another round, so it's okay. Oh, God. Edgy. You can do it, girl. Oh, my God, that went up my butt. 
My name says you berserker, and that thing went up my butt. What? <laughs> and Lord help me, I also got really into Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> I got a subscription. I now exist on the server. I'm having fun. I think I like the fact that you can also kind of like play it as a single player game as well if you want. I appreciate that a lot, honestly. <laughs> but I got friends on it too, so I don't have to be so antisocial. It's actually kind of fun. Ah, I'm getting my ass kicked. Okay, I'll be back. I'm gonna have my insurance policy known as Dragonov. Got her! Oh my god, that took longer than it should have. Whew, she was hard. <laughs> Actually, June kept kicking my ass, funny enough. But regardless, so, redemption for our boy, Bruce. Let's see what's up with him today. As she has the vapors. I like that. That was worth it. <laughs> this is Edgy Berserker signing off on Tekken Tag Tournament 2. Next episode, I'll see y'all later. Bye now.